high friends was served this is our cave from 360 reader. It's time to talk about the best tips and tricks to fix air or proximity saving not working on iPhone in iOS 17 or later. With air or proximity saving, sharing files between two iPhones is as seamless as you can ever imagine. To bring this feature into action, all you have to do is just hold your iPhone on your friend's iPhone to share a file. Though this new add-on is pretty reliable, it doesn't always work as expected. And when that happens, you feel like dealing with a really buggy feature, but both or not, as I have found out, some pretty reliable tips and tricks to fix this issue. That said, let's get started. First and foremost, I would recommend you to hard reset your iPhone. If you can't share files using the Aero proximity saving feature, hard reset your iOS device as it has long been exceptionally effective in getting rid of random software glitches. To do so, press and quickly release the volume up button, then press and quickly release the volume down button, then you have to hold down the power button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. It's worth pointing out that AirDrop proximity saving feature supports only iPhone X or iPhone XS or later, so make sure both the devices are fully compatible for this new feature. Next up, I would suggest you to disable enable AirDrop proximity saving feature. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone, then tap on general. After that, tap on AirDrop. Now turn off the toggle next to bringing devices together. Now reboot your iPhone and once your iPhone has rebooted, go back to the settings app and then turn on the toggle next to bringing devices together. Now try to save your files using this new feature by just holding your iPhone close to another's iPhone. And if the issue is gone or for that matter, if you are able to save your files this way, then you have gotten the better of the problem. And finally, I would recommend you to update the software. If the proximity saving feature is yet to kick in, there might be a software bug preventing this new feature from working properly. To get it and open the settings app on your iPhone, now tap on general, then tap on software update and finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS and that's all there is to it. So these are the best tips and tricks to fix error proximity saving not working on iPhone in iOS 17 or later. Hopefully you have gotten a better of the problem and this new add-on has started to work as expected. If you found this video helpful do like and share it and i'll see you in the next video with more such handy iphone tips and tricks till then stay safe and have a great time bye, -bye.